shared a story with me that I will now share with you all. When Chris was in school, he struggled very much, and Crystal called Autism Tennessee's helpline for support. Autism Tennessee was able to connect Crystal with the resources and an attorney to advocate for his needs. Crystal credits that phone call to our helpline and those supports with changing the trajectory of Chris's life, allowing him to eventually graduate high school and attend college. Memorializing Chris with this scholarship paves the way for Autism Tennessee to support many more students as they achieve their higher education goals. My favorite role as a board member at Autism Tennessee is serving on this scholarship committee because I have the opportunity to review every submission. Due to the diverse communication strategies utilized by those on the spectrum, we accept submissions in a variety of modes. This year's finalists took three very different approaches. One was a video submission. One began with a narrative in a dream world where the applicant was normal. And the other one shared his hopes and dreams. Each applicant also submitted two letters of recommendation with glowing anecdotes about their character. Autism Tennessee believes that there are many teens and adults on the autism spectrum who demonstrate kindness and work tirelessly to fight bullying and encourage developing friendships. In partnership with Captain Spectrum, we recognize and honor the legacy of Chris Miller with the post-secondary educational scholarship. This year's $1,000 scholarship will be awarded to Evan Jennings, and the two additional finalists, Seth Collings and Kyle Davis, will receive $250 towards their education as well. Thank you all so much for allowing me to share Chris's story with you. And now I'm welcoming Kathleen to the stage. She is a novice auctioneer, but I'm sure she's going to nail it um, for the live auction part of this event. <laughs> 